the future champion novices chase is next this is a two and a half minor again and the witch king at the top former joshua sutherland decider nebras and david robertson holland and gnarly the moment for matt cooper saint hernando darren thompson black bess for graham clitterbuck cleopatra leon von rinsburg pompey adrenaline vinnie gerard and seven bridges road for martin lee a field of nine called in and away and the Matt Cooper pair are the ones who are going to put the pace to the race for lots of things. It's a short run to the first, which is a ditch, and he's gone already, and so is Pompey Adrenaline. So two down at the first, Narlini moment, and Pompey Adrenaline both out at the first as they get to the second, and the rest of them are over that one okay. So drama right from the outset in this novice chase then. But Holland, the remaining Matt Cooper runner, is in the lead from the Witch King as they get to the third and there's another one gone there it's Leon van Rensburg's Cleopatra has gone this time so absolute carnage in this one and we've only got what have we got left six left after we started off with nine we've only jumped three fences so far and it's Holland in the lead this is why the jumps can be far more fun to get involved with if you're contemplating getting involved in it or uh, and ooh, Darren Thompson's horse did he went there as well. If you're a flat trainer who looks at the jumps and thinks, I don't want to get into that, well, you, you see what can happen here. We've got a grade one race, and three of them have fallen already. And I'm all over that one. And Matt Cooper could well pick himself up a grade one winner. If a few more fall, and Holland is in the lead. As they get over this ditch. From the Witch King second, St. Hernando third, and Decider Nebras in fourth. With Seven Bridges Road, and then finally Black Bess as they come to take fence seven. Which they're all over okay, though Black Bess didn't look like she jumped it all that brilliantly. So Holland in the lead then. We've got the Scottish Champion Hurdle and the Scottish Grand National at the corner's three race card from here. It's the big novice race and it's certainly been a thriller so far as they race downhill towards the next and Holland is in the lead from St. Hernando in second the Witch King is third then decided Nebras four seven Bridges Road is five and Black Bess is last of the six that remain and they're quite well strung out and Holland is leading by a couple to St. Hernando and the Witch King as they get to this next one and Holland took a dive at that one got away with it though but has been joined and passed now by St. Hernando so St. Hernando is the new leader but Holland is fighting back on the inside the Witch King is next then Decider Nebra Seven Bridges Road and Black Bess all getting a little bit closer and this is wide open this one with Holland and St. Hernando disputing the lead the Witch King on its own in third and then the other three virtually in a line this time and Nebras just hit a bit of a flat spot and is now the back marker. But Holland on the inside of St. Hernando. The Witch King coming up on the outside of them as they take that next one. Seven Bridges Road is back in fourth. Then Black Bess and Decider Nebras. St. Hernando into number 12. Over it clear in the lead. Decider Nebras made a mistake at the back. St. Hernando, Holland, the Witch King, Black Bess has moved through nicely into fourth. Seven Bridges Road certainly looks a bit one paced back in fifth and decided Nebras may be the first one remaining in the race who's beaten. They've only got four furlongs to go and they've only got four, three more fences to get over. And it's St. Hernando, four to get over. In fact, this is the fourth last mistake there by Holland. And it's St. Hernando who's gone for home, I think, from Holland, the Witch King, and then Seven Bridges Road and Black Bess trying to run on as they come down to the third last. St. Hernando gets over it in the lead from Black Bess and the Witch King. Seven Bridges Road is now back in fourth. Then comes Holland, decided Nebras trying to run on. They've just got two to take. This is the final, it's the second last. And over it goes. St. Hernando clearing the lead, being chased hard by Black Bess and the Witch King as they come down towards the final fence. And it's St. Hernando who leads by three or four. St. Hernando gets over it nicely in the lead. Black Bess and the Witch King over it in second and third. But it's St. Hernando who's clear inside the final half furlong. And St. Hernando is going to take it. This is going to be one for Darren Thompson. 
Saint Hernando, which is the witch king, his second black best third, then seven bridges road, four off the side of Nebras. And finally Holland. And Darren Thompson. That's himself a winner. With Saint Hernando, the Witch King second for Joshua Sutherland, Black Best third for Graham Clitterbock, Seven Bridges Road for Martin Leader was fourth, and Decider Nebras for David Robertson was fifth.